Hi everybody, it's Liz again. Um, I'm just giving you an update on uh, today's uh, busy schedule. I'll be admitted today, so I'm going to take you through my journey. And um, the purpose for this admission is for me to see the necessary specialists. Uh, with regards to my organs to see where the damage is and what type of damage and then also um, have a look at my heart and my lungs which has been giving me problems and uh, uh, everything else hi guys um, at the hospital as you can see in the back there we go I'm at the hospital we're gonna do a lung function test now see what the result is and then they're going to book me in and then from there we'll see the cardiologist and the rheumatologist, dermatologist and all the others. Happy days! I'm here doing my lung function test today. I've done about seven tests. I've done my COVID test yesterday. I'm negative. After my lung function test I'll be admitted. This is where I currently am. I'll show you the lung function machine. Another two tests they'll do and after that two tests I'll be done. I'll go to uh, the admissions and then they'll let me sh uh, admit me for the day. Uh, I'm sure I'll be here for about approximately a week. Okay, so we've done the ECG and I'm coming for X-rays and for, for I think mostly for the chest and then we'll see from there what is the next step. I am so hungry. I haven't eaten the whole day. The admission process was so long. So let's hope that I can finish quickly so I can eat something. So far I got my lung test back. It's very good, very positive. Yay! I'm happy. Okay guys, I am uh, booked in. I'm sharing a room with five other ladies. Um, usually they would separate the beds with the cupboards and they've changed that. So now there's no separation at all. Um, they gave me a drip and then put some antibiotics in and then they came to take lunch. Well, they took the blood from my pulse. That was probably the worst, worst thing I have experienced. It started swelling up and then it started bleeding. This was insane, far beyond it's insane. Um, you can still see that there's um, the drip in there. Um, they don't have any security with regards to locking your stuff up, so it's basically exposed and for everybody to see. And I've got my laptop here, my wallet, and my cards, and money, and my phone, and my bag. Um, so I think that's very unprofessional of a hospital that's a paying hospital, it's not a government hospital. But yes, um, that just happened. Um, I'm in a lot of pain with this um, in taking blood from my pulse. Um, but let's see what happens. Apparently they had to take it from the pulse to see how much oxygen I have. Uh, the lung test, as I said, came back good. So I'm very happy about that. Um, did some x-rays of the chest and we'll see what is the um, outcome of that once they get it. And for today they finished. I feel okay apart from the pain in my hand. I feel okay. My arm is quite numb. Um, yes. I will update you later a little bit later on and collaborate all these small little videos 
and to give you a better experience of how things went but that was today um, I don't know if I'll record a lot in the room itself uh, I don't want to disrupt anybody there there's a lot of sick patients there but yes that's that for today I think Anyways guys, do me a favor, I have my Backer Buddy account, please, please find it in your heart to donate something towards my medical bills, and then down you can like, you can subscribe, I'll teach you everything that I know of systemic scleroderma and my journey going forward, um, people living with family members with the same condition can follow me and I'll explain to you what you can do for us. A lot of people think that there's things that they can do um, in a medical sense. I don't think that's possible. That's why we've got doctors and specialists. I think, you know, just make it comfortable, be understanding, be sympathetic and um, be supportive. Uh, that's really all we need from our loved ones. So guys, this is it for me. Please like, subscribe and support my channel. I appreciate it and all love. Enjoy. Bye-bye.